Hello and welcome back to your very own health and wellness channel, Bloom Tales. Our today's topic is something very interesting, something very useful and something which you will not get anywhere in the internet or in your textbooks. Something which only trained dietitians know. What is that? And that is how to calculate your calorie intake. How to know how much calories you require per day and from that how do you calculate your protein, your carbohydrate and your fat intake. Isn't it interesting? So let's get started. So for this, we need to refer to the ICMR RDA table. The Indian Council of Medical Research has issued a daily chart, a recommended daily allowance chart, which tells us how many calories we need. Now this depends on two things, your gender and the level of activity that you do. So if you're a male, your calorie requirements are higher than that of a female. Also, if you are doing very physically intensive work, then also your calorie requirements are very high. Now let's take an example. For example, if I need to calculate my calorie requirements, then let's look at this chart. So according to the ICMR chart, my RDA requirement for calories is 1900 kilocals. So this is the total amount of energy that I need in a day. From this, I need to calculate my carbohydrate, protein and fat composition. Before we do our calculations, let's know certain facts. What are they? 1 gram of carbohydrate gives you 4 kilo calories. 1 gram of protein also gives you the same amount that is 4 kilo calories. But 1 gram of fat gives you 9 kilo calories which is more than double. So keeping these figures in mind, let's continue with our calculation. So I know that I need 1900 kilo calories per day. Remember, 60% of your total calorie intake should come from carbohydrates. So if I do 60% of 1900, it comes to 1140 kcal. So this is the total energy which should be coming from the carbohydrate food group. Now knowing this is not enough. I mean, I don't go to the market and I say, I need this much calorie of food. I need to convert it into grams. I need to know a quantity for it. So here we will use the information that I have already told you earlier. So 4 kilocalories I'm getting from 1 gram of carbohydrate. So 1140 kilocalories, if we follow the unitary method of calculation, will come to 285 grams. So now I know that I need 1140 cals and 285 grams of carbohydrate in my diet. Now come to proteins. An average Indian needs 1 gram of protein per kg body weight. Now this is your ideal body weight that I am talking about. So if my weight is 60, then I need 60 grams of protein. So I know the amount and now I need to convert it into calories. Like I told you earlier that 1 gram of protein gives you 4 kilo calories. So 60 grams of protein will give you 240 kilos of calories. Very simple, very clear. So now we know the calories that we are getting from our carbohydrates and the calories that we are getting from our proteins. It is so much easier to calculate the calories required from your fats. So we add 1140 plus 240 which comes to 1380 and now we minus that with 1900. So that becomes 520 calories. So 520 calories I need from fats. Now again we go back to that same formula that 1 gram of fat gives me 9 kilo calories. So now if we calculate 520 calories we know that we get it from 58 grams of fat. So this is a very simple calculation from which we can find out how much of carbohydrates to eat, how much of proteins to eat and how much of fats to include in our diet. Please check the description box for the link of the ICMR RDA chart. You will find it very useful. So you know for special conditions like for a pregnant woman or a lactating mother, there are additional requirements. For a growing child, there are additional requirements. So that table we need to refer. So please do check out the link. So wasn't this very useful? Do let me know. If you find value in my content, do not forget to like, subscribe, comment and press the bell icon. Thank you.